Buffalo side of all and deference to that speed plays him shallow at third game time temperature and he blew the high fastball right by him strikes on still shining out in the gap in right center field off the outside and up a little bit with that fastball what the look of the the sun and the shadows the sun shining off the hitters backdrop into the eyes of the hitters as Kane strikes out Schaefer with the high fastball on the inside two overall for the year with six straight wins here is Altuve and a foul that will go back into the second deck off to the right in hits in the National League Ooh, the big curveball and he chased it strike two yeah he does oh and two he struck him out with the fastball and Kane has struck out the first two and Madison Bumgarner started his game striking out the side here's Jed Lowry and he takes a called strike any other shortstop in the majors up till now the former Stanford star change up whoa where was that one now a crew chief back of the plate change up and a foul down off the foot he's got that shin guard the half shin guard over the two strikeouts and only 16 walks The high fastball popped up. Side the ball in foul ground. And I actually had trouble finding him in the crowd because you just fit in so well. Nice. <laughs> All right, we got to talk about the first pitch. JT Snow and you had a little uh, pregame drive competition, but he told you you can't bounce. One like 310, so that was yeah. pretty good. Yeah. You'd pick up maybe in a scramble competition. Yeah, I mean, hey, do you still get nervous before a major? Yeah, um, well. I mean, I'm not nervous tonight, but tomorrow when I walk on the first tee, I'm not nervous when you walk on the first tee, then, then you shouldn't be going out there because it doesn't mean anything. BG, and uh, thanks to Dustin Johnson. Good luck to him. Brett Wallace, the hitter, after J.D. Martinez hit a fly ball to fairly deep center for out number one on top here in the second. And that's back to the screen. High fastball. Well, he's got a powerful swing. He has never had much success at the big league level. Three and two, the count, and he struck him out with a changeup, and that was that was a beauty. Swing, you realize it's not. That's a foul down the right field line. A few moments ago, we heard the the whistle, a salute from the historic ship, the Potomac. FDR, Franklin Delano Roosevelt, and it's one and two now to. You can hire it for bay cruises and that sort of thing, business functions. Here comes Arias. Very nice Bay Area from Comcast Sportsnet. Full team coverage of the U.S. Open from the networks of NBC Sports. Ball one to Bogusevic facing Matt Kane. Five nothing Jacks. Here's Dwayne Kuyper. All right, John Bogusevic with a swing and a miss. Hit one 310 yards today. Yeah, he hit it. Smoked it. Bogus seven fouls it out of four. Well, we'll just say March in town for this game. Two Which and two on one of the NBC Sports uh, family of networks. Yes, it is. This is chopped <laughs> foul. He really was. He, and who wouldn't be, right? When you come up here, especially, you get the look of the bay and the, the ships and the boats and the whole panorama. Bogus seven is out four three. I'm going to bring up Chris Snyder. Three home runs, 16 driven in. Where he takes the pitch down low. Rare to see a one nothing score in Arlington. And Snyder comes up empty pretty quick though. Snyder breaks his bat and rolls his foul. Oh, they posted it now. There you go. The season. What do you had about what nine hits in three days? He here? did. One two pitch. And Snyder had a good rip and he fouls it back. Two two pitch. Oh. Right out number four. To the ball first. Now yeah, explain that one to me. You can move it. <laughs> Obviously it does then. Half takes a strike, one ball and one strike. He is. He's heading out of McCovey Cove. He's heading out into the open water. 
One two pitch. And that takes high two and two. Pretty. That's what he was doing on the special assignment. Go, yeah. Got him. Five strikeouts. He scored seven runs on nine hits. Strike to Schaefer with Sandoval in at third, thinking that Schaefer might. But uh, uh, yeah, uh, you just never know. Boy, Kate right now is painting the corners. They have a healthy lineup in there tonight. The only guy that's hacked off right now is Pagan. Lifted foul and out of play. Altuve to follow. And that is a foul. We thought for a second like Molinsky was going to call that fair and then in the middle of his call he changed his mind. Foul. Although Brad Mills is coming out. So I mean, the don't, don't you go back and look for the mark on the dirt. Well and Mills is. You know when it bounces before the base, but if the the hitter has to really react, absolutely. Foul back. He blimp shots. Oh my goodness! This is the roll. Got him. Check in with Amy G. Thanks, Amy. Here's El Tuve. Tuve looks at a strike. When he went to college, he was recruited as a position player to Cal Poly, and then he had a good arm to talk and work on his broadcasting skills. There's a strike to El Tuve, one and two. Two and a half, three days to work on it. Mike used to go in about having a fine year. This little guy's having a fine year. Destroying it down there. They just brought him up. Yeah. He got him. He's five six. Here's Lowry. Lowry takes a strike. Two spots. Twelve is twelve. And this one is down low to. He's not a huge guy. He was not a highly recruited player at all. Plus, what I like about him is he's got the old school stance. Popped out of play. Two and two. Fans want Kane to strike out the side. Melky Cabrera running hard, and he will track it down as he runs over the mound, and that'll end the inning. For the Astros against Matt Kane. It hasn't affected his sharpness so far. Kind of hung a slider there, and Martinez ripped it foul. He scored eight runs in four innings. Fastball right at the knees. Beauty from Kane. Strike two in four innings. And that would be zero for Houston so far. One, two. And a curveball. Martinez did well just to get a piece of it. But six consecutive starts, he's been the winner. And that curve just off the plate inside. Two and two. What a year. You guys had a great career, but at a very high level right now. Fastball got him looking. Strikeout number eight already for Kane. For the series, that's our Chevron pitching matchup. Fred Wallace fouled one right off of Posey. Be traded at the deadline. And there's a lot of interest, I would have to think. Another fastball right at knee level. Pinpoint location tonight for Matt Kane. 0 and 2. High fastball struck him out. Because he's got strikeout stuff, but not typically quite like this. That one pulled in the dirt outside one and one. Yeah. But I think Mike likes to say he he really does it. He goes for the strikeout when he needs a strikeout. With his one two pitch. 
Posey tried to hold it to get the call. And the one that counts saw it that way. So now it's two and two. Johnson puts it in play with some crazy spin on it to Terrio for the third out. So Matt Cain still has not allowed anyone to reach first base. He and the Giants with an eight nothing lead. Has not had much of it of late. Brian Bogusevic, left-handed hitter with a lot of power, takes a changeup. Inning. Man, and every day. The uh, the batteries ran out on the humidor. Fastball just blew it right by Bogusevic. One two. Well, the Civic stays alive. Has just overpowered these Astros. Here's his one two. That one right there. Strike three called. Number ten for Kane. Ah, oh, you're right about that. There's oh. a deep drive by Chris Snyder. Cabrera will catch it at the wall. Wow. Two down. Well, we all thought this was gone. Melky Cabrera got to the wall in just a little mini leap, and he puts it away. Chris Snyder's thinking, how did that happen? In our part, that's a big play. And Kane still has not allowed a base runner. Two down, and it's Bixler as a pinch hitter taking strike one with the curveball. Strike two here tonight. Oh, two. Just high with the fastball. Bixler, no contact. Posey to finish the put out. And a game that's been about the Giants offense is now about Matt Kane. Ten nothing. Not had a base runner in this game through six innings. Crawford is now at short. Arias moves from short to third. So here's Schaefer. And Schaefer looks at a strike. 87 pitches for Matt Kane. Not one base runner in this game for the Astros. And the next pitch is wide. Schaefer has struck out twice. Kane's got 11 in the game. On deck is Jose Altuve. This is flipped foul, and it's now one and two. Two to Schaefer. And that bounces in. It's two and two. This infield is aware of that. Three and two. That crowd. And this is hit out into the alleyway. A long run for Blanco. And Blanco's going to dive. And he makes the catch. Just an unbelievable catch here in the seventh inning. This is unbelievable. Into the gap, and he was in that direction in the first place. And then at the last moment, it looks like no, but it makes the desperation dive, and then he has to hold on to it as he hits the deck. Look at the concentration there, and look at that play. And Matt Kane was watching as well. Yeah. And maybe saying the same thing. Are you kidding me? <laughs> and he tips his cap.